Hello everyone, whether you're returning or new here, welcome. As you can see here, I took a scrap piece of wood, drilled some holes in the corners, and put toothpicks in my favorite sticks, and broke them. So I had to redo it. This is going to be the base for a oven bake polymer clay sculpture that I'm making. So here I'm taking my aluminum armature wire and I'm starting to shape up the form of what my sculpture is going to be. With the hind legs and the main frame of the body done, I start working on a piece to make the front legs and attach that along the body, sort of like the spine of the body to put those two pieces together. And now I'm going to take some aluminum foil and or tin foil and uh, bulk up the body a little bit to give it some substance before I put clay on it so that I'm not using all clay and wasting it. I can use this to be the insides. And with my foil base all set, I'm ready to start adding some clay and getting the basic shape of my sculpture in place so that I can continue to layer upon layer and get the size and shape that I exactly want. And with that, I have my base layer complete. I did the, uh, the neck and the head off camera before uh, it went into the oven for its first bake. And once it was baked, it was good and hard and ready to go for more sculpting.
And now I just start bulking up the parts of the body that need a little bit more bulk to them to give the final shape to the sculpture. As you can see here, I'm smoothing and packing some clay in around the front legs. And it was shortly after this that I realized the front legs were now in the correct, incorrect position, not right. So I ended up having to cut them off and drill some holes and redo the front legs, which you will see later on when they uh, appear in the better position that looks so much better. And here I'm just working on the seams between uh, parts of the body where I wrapped more and more to make it blend and be much smoother. I had to drill some holes in the head so that I could put the antlers on that I bent out of the wires. Thank you for watching this video. This is the end of part one. Part two will be coming soon.